How are you doing guys from Yonkers Voice? Today we're sitting here with Officer Omi Medina, the youngest police officer in Yonkers. He joined the force at the age of five. Today he's seven, so he's been on the force for three years and he needs 17 more years to go before he retires. So he, he will be retiring at 20. That will be the youngest, the youngest police officer probably in the country or the world to retire. How happy are you be being a police officer, Omi? It is great to be a police officer so you could, so you could catch all, all of the criminals. And um, do you remember when you joined the police department? Uh, I don't know about that. Well, you do know because we spoke about it. Remember, kindergarten, you were four years old? Uh, yeah. Wait, I, I don't think I was four years old since I was in kindergarten. So how old were you? I think I was like five years old. Good enough. So you've been a police officer for two years. You need 20 years to retire. So you will be retiring more or less at the age of 2021, 20, right? Yes, sir. Thank you. And as you know, at 2021 is the age that most people are joining the police office, you know, the, the police department, and you will be retiring. Now, when you think you will become detective, maybe by the age of nine? Yes, sir. Nine years old, and you will be detective Omi Medina. Now, kids of your age, do they ask you questions about how you joined the police department? No, sir. No, sir. You seem to be a very sharp police officer. Now, how you like being a police officer? Tell me what you like the most, you know, become, for being a police officer. The most I like is being a police officer. It's because that, that we can um, stop people making um, bank robberies or jewel heists. But, but, but now, on a serious note, you know that right now you are hoping to become a real police officer. Not that you're not real now, you are real. But we want you with a real badge, a real uniform, a real hat, you know, and being a real police officer. And you know that to become a, a real police officer, what you need to do? I need to do is do my job. And your job is go to school, get good grades, and stay out of trouble. Yes, sir. Now, what about this car here? Is this your, your cruiser? You hope that you're going to be driving a, driving a cruiser when you become a real police officer? Yes, sir. So now, if you have your friends watching this interview, and uh, what would you like to tell them? Do you have a message for them, for the people that are going to be watching you? No, sir. Well, you got to have a message, Officer Medina. You have to have a message because they're looking at you and they say, when I grow up, I want to be just like Officer Medina. They, they're watching you. So you have a message to them. Maybe, guys, stay out of trouble. Yes, sir. Do you do your homework every day, Omi? Yes. Your grades are good? Yes. Are you an A student or a B student? Uh... A student. Are you serious? So you already have half a job done to become a police officer. Officer, if you are an A student, you a good boy, you doing your homework and you studying hard, half of your work is done to become a police officer. The only thing you really need is be 18 or 19, whatever the age is to become a police officer. Yes, sir. Now, is your daddy and your mommy happy? that you want to be a police officer? Yes, sir. But, but let's talk, don't give me, I know that police officers like to give me yes sir, no sir, but you have an opinion. I want you to talk, I want you to tell us, to tell the audience how happy you are, you know, what do you do, because every stop and shake event that I go, you there. Do people come and shake your hand and talk to you? Yes. And are you happy? What do, what do they tell you? The, the, Come on, don't be shy. They tell me that, that I look cool. 
that you are cool? Yeah. But we know that. But you also that you're strong? Yep, I'm strong. And I heard that is a special police officer that gave you that patch, right? Yes. It was a captain, I hear. Uh, you know his name? Name? Uh, I don't know the name. I think it's Captain Pappas. Is that it? Captain Pappas. So give a big shout out to Captain Pappas and tell him thank you for the badge. Captain Pappas. 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 Thank you for the badge. And hopefully you will be serving in the Yonkers Police Department before he retires. Yes, sir. He might be the police commissioner. Who knows? Um, yes. Yes. So, guys, this is it. Now, we have Officer Omi Medina, son of one of our members, Omi, Omi Medina and uh, Jennifer, right? Jen Stephanie. Stephanie Medina. She's right across the camera watching this interview. She's proud of her boy. Actually, we're all proud of you, Omi. We all love to see you. I love to see you when I go to the hand and stop and shake. I like to talk to you. And I'm glad that you took time from your you know, hard work as a police officer to give us this interview. Now, I hope that uh, Sergeant Dean Papanopoulos, I, I always have a hard time saying his name, is okay with this interview because they don't like police officers to speak on camera unless they have permission from police department. Did you get permission from the police department? Yes. You sure? Yes, I'm sure. So say hello to Yonkers Voice, tell them bye, and uh, we will see them again soon. Give it a handshake. Bye, give him a bye. And that's you and I, let's say, stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. For the next episode. For the next episode. Of Yonkers Voice. Of Yonkers Voice. Omi Medina. Umi Medina. Check it out. Check it out. Give it a point of finger of them. I always end up. See you guys later. Wait, I want to test the thing. Say it. About um, Yonkers Voice. This is our first video about a little kid that is joining the Yonkers Police Force in New York City. We are actually had that about bank robbers and jewelry stores have been robbed every time. So that's why we are a new officer to the police force. So we need you to res to solve these crimes, right, Omi? Yes, sir. And with the with the robbers or like that, it's called a heist. You guys heard it from the police officer, Omi Medina. He's the man. If you need him, you, you are you also a private investigator or not yet? Yeah, I'm also that. He's also that. So if you have any cases that you need him to work on, to resolve, you contact Mr. Omi Medina. You can send us a, vo a message to Yonkers Voice, and we will give you the message and who to contact these people, correct? Yeah, correct. Checking out, Yonkers Voice, always focused and determined to bring to you what is important. Check it out. Peace out. Give me five. Out, guys.